Uh-oh. Right. Hey guys, hope you're having a great day today. All right, today we started a little bit different, not getting coffee. Already had my coffee, but here we are at the shop once again. Today is a Yay. husband spends the day with me today. What's up? What's up? Live, so we're gonna have a good day. So we got up early, we had a couple of appointments we had to go to, a couple um, meetings and things to get done, and so now I'm like, okay, time to pick up the camera Ooh, and start. Oh, today's gonna be this today. It's going to be? Band label maker. Label makers, because oh I didn't get to finish my my work here before, so I'm like, okay. So today we're gonna try to make it all happen in one day. So we've got the afternoon here, it's about noon right now. We are just gonna grab a piece of paper, we gotta go head out so we can get to another appointment and then uh, get going with our day, so we're gonna go. Right. Husband's coming, I told him I was gonna announce what we're doing today, so I'll be announcing what we're doing today, so it's sadness. Sadness for Greg. Sadness for Greg. For what? What's happening? They don't know what's happening. What do you mean? Why is it sadness? Where I'm going, what I'm doing. Why? <laughs> It's Greg's not sad. It's, it's not worry. sad. Yeah, it's worry. There you go. It's worry. So, my big thing is that Lauren and Matthew and I are going and flying up to Michigan this week to go have her shower with our family in Michigan. So, Daddy's going to have a. We're going to have an awesome time. So, I wish I had two cameras. We got so much stuff. They're going to have like dollar store dinner challenge. <laughs> I'm like, who does that? So usually I've prepared. Does. He does. Usually I prepare and have meals, and I'm like, you know what? I'm not gonna do any of that. So I, we do have to go to the store because you know I have zero. Food. I mean, I have food, just stuff that they're gonna need and self-sufficient, like cereal and, you know, macaroni and cheese in a box and hot dogs. You know, fun stuff. So we're gonna run and just pick up a very small when mom is away dad grocery haul, and then uh, that's what we're gonna do today. They're gonna have fun. So that that's happening this week. So it's gonna be. It'll be sad. And, I'm sorry. He doesn't no, want to talk it'll about be it. Fine. It'll, it'll be, be fine. He'll have a good time. So I wish I had the camera good. for him at home because they're going to have a good time. Uh, I don't yes. like, sep I have separation anxiety. Yes, separation anxiety. I'm like a puppy. <laughs> Like poor Maxine. Maxine's gonna be missing her mama. So, so we're gonna. We'll she'll do. It's we'll gonna be busy. good. It's gonna be a good time. So we'll bring you along there. Take you up to all of the fun things that we enjoyed in Michigan when we were there, and family and house where I grew up. All that fun stuff. So it'll be a good. That's at the end of the week. So make sure you keep watching. So, but today is I gotta get a grocery haul in because Dad doesn't know how to make casserole. He doesn't know how to make bulgogi in the pressure cooker. So we're gonna we're gonna make something easy. So we're gonna I go. Daddy doesn't want to know how. He doesn't even want to know how. He's like, Dodger challenge, kids. Here we go. So we're gonna go ahead. I thought that was a good idea. That's a great idea. I'm, well, it, it'll be a, the challenge for me. will be finding them stuff that's like good for them to eat, and not like total junk. And they're gonna want to pick cookies on their food. Like Twizzlers for dinner. Twizzlers, Captain so Crunch cereal. It, it'll be interesting to, to try to balance. And, See what they can come up with. So yeah, I'm gonna buy some likes. veggies and fruit to throw in there. So in hopes that they would want some, you know, something healthy. But oh, this is what's gonna happen. The kids are like in the evenings. The kids are gonna be coming upstairs, going, oh, I think I need something real to eat. And they'll be able to go in there and uh, get like a piece of celery. Whatever. You know, and Captain Crunch. Oh, they're gonna love it. Oh yeah. So it'll be a good time. So we're gonna go head out right now, and then we'll keep talking about our day. And we're gonna have a date dinner tonight too. So because it's our our last outing today, is a as a couple before I leave, so. Okay, so we're gonna go, we're gonna have a good day, so let's go and come along with me and my work today. Okay, let's go. It is a gorgeous day. This is the day that mom wants to be at the pool, but instead we're gonna get some household stuff done, so it's gonna be great. Let's go have a good All day. All right, first up, the mask. We're gonna, we're gonna be out shopping, baby. Oh my goodness, I love to so shop. So excited, it's your mask one of my is favorite so beautiful, so. All right, we're gonna go in here, we're gonna go in the bank and do some stuff. I'm not gonna film in there because they'll probably. Did you say my mask was beautiful? It is. It's so look at light. look at the look at the mask that Amy got for me. Cause you know it's what? a it's a five cent paper mask. No. Now let's show yours. <laughs> mine is made so, by oh, mine is made by the seamstress. Who's got Seam, the not so, seamstress? So who's a, got the beautiful mask? The, no. <laughs> this you know why? Okay, people, you guys get this mask. Using a mask that somebody else used is disgusting. Mm -hmm. Like I one time didn't have this one, and I like this is when we we didn't really have to wear them, and I wore one of somebody else's, and I'm like. Oh my goodness, this stinks like oh, their yeah. breath and it's just nasty. So I'm not letting anybody touch my mask. You guys can have yours. If you want to keep one of your own, go ahead. Like the kids have their own. I marked their letter on it. So they have their own mask. So everybody has their own. So you basically need your own mask, honey. Oh, okay. So maybe you, get, you need to get your own mask. <laughs> Greg don't care. He's like, whatever, throw it. He's like, got me a mask. So I'm like, ugh, oh, honey. Yeah, I'll take the time and order myself a mask. You won't even be able to order them. Where can you order them at? I've literally bought it. 
like 50 of these masks for all the kids and everybody else. I don't even know. Comes down to making it all official and give everybody a mask. Everybody gets one. But Greg's got the big giant one in the shop. It's got full of spray paint. Uh -huh. Okay, we're going to go in. Okay, just wanted to clear that up. Who's There's no the, clear. Who's got the fancy mask? I've got a fancy. <laughs> because those ones are disgusting. They're so gross. Greg had, no, you bought one with Jade and you have a nice one. Mm -hmm. Where's that at? Uh, it's probably hanging up in my shop. There you go. So it's not that I didn't buy one for you. You just don't carry it with you. Let's go. Okay, okay. We're going in. Come on. All right, finished up the banking in there. Got what we had what? to get done. So learn some good information. You know, like we have this, I have my little mask here that it's thicker. It's like harder to breathe with. Yeah. And Greg has his paper ones, you know. Which are fine. It's fine. It's just it doesn't have like my good paint mask ones. It's got the cartridges where you're like, <sighs> like the air comes out, right? No one's gonna wear that in public. All, like, ah, all no one's gonna wear that in public. So Masks get off, bogged up. It's so bad. But see, see, my uh, thing it's is like they tell you to wear masks, but they you can't find one anywhere. I found those ones I got for the kids from Target. I think Lauren got some from Big Lot. So I'm like, where would you even find masks? At? So then we were in there, and the guy said, I wrote it down, Neofit Pro, Neofitpro.com. I'm like went on there, and they're like inexpensive and cheap. He had one with like little breathing things or something mm -hmm. just because he has to wear them all the time so you need some mask check out neo yeah. fit pro they have like a lot of them and they're really um, well he said it was really good for his son who has to wear yeah. one like work all, all day, day at work and exactly him, so so i was like oh so they got some they even got ones with the mouths open you know so if you need a mask go check that place out because they're like five dollars i think i paid six bucks for a material one that's really thick to breathe through i'm like <sighs> That's all good. It's all good. It's all good. So check that out. So we're gonna go ahead now. Go drop off some more paperwork. Lots of running. It's already gonna be two o'clock and we still haven't even gone shopping yet, honey. That's crazy. It's so crazy. So we're gonna go do that right after we get done. Where we gotta go run to. With so. this message. One more right time. After this message. Right after this message. All right, done with our run-in that we have to do for business. Official and documentation process. Work and everything else. I'm like, okay, let's just be done. It's like Yay. already two o'clock. I'm missing tanning weather right now. I'm just kidding. Oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, that's, are no you missing tanning. your pool? <laughs> no tanning weather. Shop. I can go do, I can go to your grocery shop and if you'd like to tan. Yeah, maybe I should have Greg over a shop. What dad does. Yeah, maybe I should do a grocery help with Greg. It would basically be popsicles dipped in sugar. That's what Pretty everybody much. would eat. And no, cabin, I'm just kidding. Cabin Crunch I'm cereal. Not, I'm not really like that. I've been no, eating not. good cooking. For he'll he'll sneak away. Years. Like if I said, honey, be responsible and get kicks good meals, he would. Mm -hmm. But he wouldn't really come up with Captain Crunch. No. The kids never, they don't really ever get. They were like, kinda, what's Captain Crunch? Yeah, sugar foods, you know, stuff like that. And that's good. We don't want them to be, you know, have problems down the road right. and stuff like they that. They have them, but they're not like, they like it's It's, a, the it's more of just a treat every right. once in a while. So while mama's, while mama's gone. It'll be great. It'll bring it. Bring it. It'll be, it. it'll be so fun. Time. It's, it's going to be a good time. So we're going to go ahead to go first. I was just going to do Aldi, but I'm like, you know, we're right by there. We might as well go to go because you never know what kind of good deals like that chicken I found that one time. You just might find the greatest deal ever. So we're going to head there first. Go see what they have because sometimes they have veggies and fruit local, which is cheap, and sometimes some lunch meat, hot dogs, and then we'll head to Aldi and uh, just pick up the rest of there. So then we'll do that, and then that'll be it for our run and take it home, and then we can go out and have some more fun. So yeah. let's go to go. Okay. Right. Show me yeah, we're, we're going to Grocery Outlet now. This is a great little store. We're going to see what kind of goodies they have. Mm, they'll have all okay. kinds of goodies. Hi, baby. Hi. You can go. Oh, look at that one, dude. Look at zoomed in so close I can't see anything. That's, what it, that's where it's at. Oh. Do you want a box? Okay. Sure. Okay. A whole box for... Yeah, I guess for five bucks? That's I, a dude, great deal. These are my favorite. This 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 closure, Daddy's favorite fruit, peaches. Salad making stuff. Every day. Every day. These kids are getting 
breakfast in bed every day. Oh, breakfast in bed. Yeah. So can we get like some uh, some potatoes for? I got potatoes at home. You do? Are you onions. sure? I got onions, potatoes. Okay. What is Maddie like in hers? Huh? What? How are? Who's gonna like? Who's gonna like uh, plain eggs? And who's bacon. gonna like fancy? Yeah, bacon and cheese. That's it. All right. Let's see. This bacon. I get bacon. You want to grab some? I got a whole bunch of them. Look at this. Whipped butter. $10. Dang, that's a big old tub of that's butter. That's a lot of butter. Good find, babe. Wait, hold on one second. It looks, it looks like it for a huge tub like that. We got this too. Hmm? Ooh, Cracker Barrel too. That's $4. We'll get one of these for you guys. Thank you. Do you want like what the guy? Yeah, uh, maple sausage would be great. This is microwave. Okay. So what are they? So looks like a granola bar. So yeah, okay. they're starving. So this is all just food for while Mama's gone. If you forget to feed them, they have some kind of like. Hey. I'm starving. starving. Thank you. Very good, babe. Oh, everybody day. loves bomb pops. Look at the whole box for $2. Do it. Grab it up. We'll stop and get a bag of ice. Grab a couple oh, I got of them. Cooler. There's only 12 in there. Oh. That could be fun. Yeah, okay. Frozen, right? Yeah, I don't think so. Get some, some of the more? fruit ones too up top. Those aren't cheap. This is a good deal. Okay, we'll get two. Yeah, that's I would, a good deal. I think so. And then we'll hope it stays good. Got there, got our goodies. That was quick. Can't clean it right away. I know, I'm like, we gotta hurry because we have all these. I'm just not used to shopping like when it's 5,000 degrees outside and yeah. you're like, you gotta get done real quick. And I'm just thinking we need gas too, so it's yeah, gonna be great. Yeah. So we're gonna run. Got those bomb pops for a really good deal. I think that'll be a nice treat for the kids. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna run to Aldi so we can get like the staples and the things they really needed. So we're gonna go ahead there right now and we'll be back going to Aldi, see what we can find in the store. Let's go. Hey, let's go. Look at that. You know what I'm saying? This is what Amy asked for. No, no. She wanted, how does yeah. this thing zoom? Oh, chocolate, peanut butter, candy cookies. Excellent no. choice, baby. You, you know what I'm seeing? I'm seeing Amy's grocery budget going out the door. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we don't sweat the little things, do we, baby? Uh, no, you don't. You don't buy them. I grab You find them strawberries? The next couple days. Very nice. Yeah. Kids will love those. It's mm. just uh oh. Mm. You get it? Mainers. What are the hot dogs? We are? Since when? 
You and the kids. Who said that? Me. Oh, okay. Do we have the hot dogs or do we got to get them at a... Huh? Oh, a Chiquita banana bit. Get, get you some Chiquitas. Oh, these are Del Monte's. Oh, they look fine. As long as they're not brown, we good. Because we go through bananas pretty quick. Oh, look at those cherries. Oh, dang. The other grapes you got look way better. Well, yeah, that's all they have. Oh, let's see. So that's not bad. So for for those of us that don't know anything about shopping, such as myself, a dollar forty nine is pretty good for a whole bag of grapes. That's right. Nine cents is better, but it's a dollar Okay. I'm just her baby. Well, I didn't know. Dollar forty nine. Okay. Just gotta feel and make sure they're kind of hard and not sticky. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, those All look beautiful. The yeah, they, those look really good. I don't know what those cherries are calling out to me. Love the cherries. Can I ask you a stupid question? Do do they make a cherry that's pitless? Uh, no kids want carrots. You kidding me? Autumn asked for carrots. Okay. She probably will. She's big on her salads. Ooh, look at your asparagus. Fresh asparagus, baby. That looks really good. So, do you eat the whole thing, or what part of the asparagus guy do you eat? I don't know. People are good. I think the bottom part. <laughs> I get the Nice. Maybe you're hiding behind the thing there. Oh, look at what is that? Oven roasted premium turkey breast. Dang. Oh, honey, you can get a giant chunk of ham in a bag. Awesome. I don't know about no straight cameras. Chicken and bologna. Honey. Baby back with ribs. Okay, she's leaving. I guess I guess my dreams are over. My dreams have been crushed. I said, I guess she's leaving. My dreams have been crushed. I'm like Greg's I back. found baby back ribs. Honey, <laughs> baby, baby back ribs, baby. Just to get the kids, to, to, to give the kids nutrition while I'm gone. Oh, don't worry. I'll make sure they're full of nutrition. You burn junk. All right. I'll make them pick all good dinners. Sure. I will. That's a dollar. Yeah, it'll be fun. <laughs> I think they'll make excellent choices, baby. Grab a white cheddar popcorn, like that, the black one. Just one. Huh? Ooh, ramens. Can't go wrong with ramen. No, not ever. Yeah, I was going to say you can't go wrong. What about the shells, though? Shells are better than macaroni. Honey, everybody knows that shells are better than macaroni. It's just the kids with pots to call. Oh, baby, you want a bag of Takis? Bag of Takis. Just one? I'm going to get like a bag of this. Takis! Taquitos! Oh, these are taquitos. Snack pack, little Jack. Does that get for kids to take with you? Yeah. You know, when you're out and about and eating food? Sure. Okay. Let's go get cereal. For what? It's just to show cereal. Like when we go? Mm. So I'll. Uh, I'll do like they like this. I get one of these. Shredded wheat. I got sugar. Sugar. Whatever. One of these, and then I'll. She just feed them straw. <laughs> straw in a box. Shredded hay. <laughs> honey, everybody loves Honey Nut Cheerios. Honey, honey Nuts are awesome. Oh, Honey Crunch and Oats right over here. 
Uh, there's my sugar, bingo. There's my sugar contribution to the family. Well, they'll appreciate oh. that. Everybody loves honey nut chili holes. That's for the kids to eat in case you know it all falls apart, baby. I don't all know. Right. I don't know about the sh the shredded sponge you got in there. That is just. Where did my fun. milk go? <laughs> it's gone. It got That's sucked so up by the sponge. Okay, so you're going against my plan here. Well, let me grab a can of refried beans in case you need that. <laughs> yeah, because everybody needs a can of refried beans when Mama's gone. <laughs> I'm trying to cover the ground so that I actually making dinner. Yes, but the whole point is kids for me to eat. let the kids have what they want for well, four days. They'll love it. It won't even be four. They can eat this. And it's literally be like three. Let's say Dad can, let's find out Dad has a meltdown and is like stuck in bed and can't move for That day. will never happen. Because there's so many kids. <laughs> Jaden, Brooklyn, help. And they can survive on macaroni cheese. Come save me. Okay, let's go. Okay, so just not you guys are gonna go get pizza, right? Yeah, like, yeah, go yeah. Find our pieces right here too. Oh, they got them here. Well, they got these ones, but look at the size of that. That's huge compared to dollar store. So why are we got? That's a pretty huge pizza. Yeah, but that's like so part of the fun is letting the kids make the pizza and stuff. They'll love it. What is the ramen kit there? He likes ramen. Oh, oh my goodness. I wonder if that's like my hot and spicy. Yeah, I bet you it is. I want to come back on the after You got it. Prettiest girl in the whole wide world. Mm. I love the way you wear that mask, baby. Yeah. Do I have to wear it on our day too? Only if you'd like to. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, so who does the almond? She ate a little gentleman might too, it depends. He's been doing the almond milk lately. So I need to get It's coffee. really not bad. Yeah. I sure do. Yeah. Do you ever find your oh look at vanilla caramel. Mm. Which one do you want? I would rather have the caramel. Because I'm a humongous fan of caramel anything. Absolutely. Oh, you might need some. Every morning. <laughs> lucky, lucky man. 14 for the kids, people. Love you. Okay. You want to share? Yeah. 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 Ooh, the air conditioner's right here. That feels good when you open up the... Open up, you're not just hanging out in the freezer section just to get air conditioned, are you, baby? I love sugar and sugar. Two of my favorite things on top of each other. That's it. My list, can you see it? Okay. I like it. She makes a list for everything, this woman. Oh, yeah. so let's go to the fun aisle. Let's see if they got some goodies. Okay. Should we grab a... Grab a what? Let me see you, Superstar. Let me see it. Let me see it. Bam! That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Ooh, coconut rolls <gasps> with sesame seeds. Those are two things that you love. Food. Why don't you get them? Yeah, you can't go wrong there. Oh, I thought you were talking about the ketchup and relish kit. Relish too? Perfect. Lucky charms. Are you feeling lucky, baby? Oh look, they got Minion cereal. Vanilla vibe. I know. I could see me picking out the, the Minion stuff. Ding-dongs. Twinkies. Okay, it's coffee. What? Where? 
<gasps> oh my gosh, I didn't understand what you're trying to tell me. He's like, what is this? Honey, this could be a life-changing thing. It's flavored, oh, it's for your thing. You yeah, it makes it. it taste like a Twinkie. That's so funny, you know me. You don't even drink coffee yet. All right, whatever. All right, baby. So good. My goggles are fogging up. All right. All right, we survived. We got food for the kids. And so if something happens to daddy and he can't provide the food, we've got refried beans and hot dogs. Okay, what exactly is this? <laughs> What, what is this plan of something's happening to daddy? No. What do you got going? No, like it's just like overwhelming daddy. So like, like, like if I just... fall and break my leg, guess what? You're gonna have to come all the way back. <laughs> no, not like the kids are all, they're all older. They're gonna be totally fine. But this is all food they wanted. So that's what I got for them. I asked them what they wanted. This is what they got. I threw in the strawberries and the watermelon. You, I feel you like know that's what? healthy. You can't get any better than that, baby. Can't be in like yogurt. How come you didn't ask me what I want? Because I know he's gonna oh, go shopping. It's gonna, I'll be Reese's peanut butter. Daddy's stuff. like, kids, let's go to P.F. Chang's. The kids are like, we don't like Chinese food, Dad. He's like, oh, the best sweet and sour chicken. They're like, we have ramen. So they only don't like it until they try it for the first time. They don't even know like, why. Oh, Mom has been holding us back for all these years. Yeah. That's all right, we're just gonna have to. Oh, gonna do the yogurts need to go in? Why you stick it over by the eggs at least? I know. I'm yeah. gonna put the milk in here. Okay. We're just gonna fly home. I dropped one. You, you did, baby. You did good. Can we put this somewhere? No. No, we don't. Uh, you did good. We said this here. Excellent shopper. Not bad. We okay. didn't shop. Oh, I can't see it. Okay, milk for you in here. There. I'm trying to get that in there. There's only one that fits. Yeah, so that's okay. Now, what's the other thing? Meat. It's okay. We'll be going home. Okay. Like right now. Yep. Not bad. Like I didn't shop at all this month, which is so good. So. We got a few things for Jane's birthday and for 4th of July. Yeah, everybody's outdoors or busier. Honey, you're smushing the bread. I did not smush you the bread. You know what? I don't even care. You can have smushed bread. Here, let's put the camera in there on the bread. Look this at the is, bread. This is Amy's version of me smushing Look it. it. Look at that bread. Look, look. it's Hi, a piece of bread. What? what? Look, look at it. Look how it's bent in half. What, this? Look at it. There it's, you go. There's no pressure on Honey, it whatsoever. Honey, it's pressure. Look. Look. Here, watch this. Watch this. I'm going to bruise the bread. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. See that smushed bread, people? I'm not held responsible. Oh, you can serve peanut butter and jelly on smush bread. How about this gorgeous? The hot dogs, you want to put those in your... No, we'll just bring yep. home. Here, I'll stay. We'll just, just fly home. I'm all dark here. It's all good. We got all this stuff. Everybody's got food. That's all that matters. So this will be that. We'll go home and do a grocery haul of... Grocery haul for when Daddy has the kids. No, I'm just kidding. I know he's going to do a great job with the kids. I don't worry about anybody starving. No, We're that's teasing. for sure. They're going to have fun. I just want to cover their bases so you never know. The world decides to shut down and end and... Dollar General closes. Yeah, they still have food to eat. Oh, and you're stuck in Michigan for three months. They won't let you <laughs> I'm not going to be stuck in Michigan for three months. It's okay, such happiness. <laughs> so I know. Anyways, Everything will be so good. It'll it's going to be, be fine. Oh. So it'll be great. So we got all these goodies and we're going to fly home, do it out, and then put away, and then we're going to go back out. We're going to go to the shop for a little bit and then decide where we're going to eat for our day night. Well, where are we going to eat? You know where I want to go. There's, where does he want to go? PF Chang's. Oh, like, I feel like that. Time. Let's do that because that's a really good place. Sweet and sour chicken. I just went with Jaden, so. Well, then pick another place. But I feel like that's a good, delicious, though. I know, it's because it is. They tra they changed their, like, we had the lo mein noodles and they changed a little bit of the recipe. It was okay. It was Did you just... ever figure out what it was that time that we were there that you wanted, like the pot stickers? Yeah, they don't make it anymore. They make they, it. Are you serious? They make it um, a little different. How so. They're changing their menu. I know it's crazy. So it's all good. That's just wrong. All right, I'm gonna have Greg here because I feel like my milk's starting to melt, or my hot dogs, or my macaroni and cheese, or something's melting in here. Right. <laughs> so I'm gonna help him. We'll be in the car in a second. All right, we got home. So this is gonna be mini grocery haul for when Daddy has the kids. So would you call it an emergency grocery haul? Me. Unnecessary. Unnecessary. Completely unnecessary. <laughs> no, because there's like freezer meals and preparing. So this is. Kids will survive even when mom's calling a grocery haul. So this is definitely, <laughs> that's right. Kids are going to survive with this. this be, you know what this is? This will be great for when uh, they're walking around in the evening and need a piece of cheese. Or... Right. Or they need like a grape or something. Okay. So we got these. These were just because we were out and they do enjoy Popeye. So I got those. I got sandwich material. All right. Sandwich material because we have um, a lot of wraps. They can make wraps to take. And we have cheese. So I got chicken and bologna. Hot dogs for them to do grill. We've got some plums here. And I got some salad. We got a box of peaches too. Those are coming here. And I got three things, like two things of grapes. There's the peaches. Everybody's going to enjoy the peaches. There's the peaches. We're a little behind. So we got a whole box of those. And then got some strawberries because they're $1.50. Got carrots. That's what they requested. Got almond milk, regular milk. Got some creamer, bananas. Just got some of these to grab with. I got some cheese over there for crackers. Peanut butter and jelly we were out of. <laughs> got this because I do have a lot of tortillas and I have cheese. They can make those little... Um, like Mexican grilled cheeses. This is just butter for $10. That was a great deal. So we got that. I just got Takis as the bag. Like, throw those over there. This is for me on my trip. Got these for $5. So 
Greg, I like that. I got eggs for him so he can make breakfast. We got two cantaloupe. I'm going to eat these before, probably. Big old watermelon and grapes. That was the discount store. Aldi. This is a good deal. Pop, bomb pop ice cream rockets for $1.99. I think there's 12 in there. So that'll be a good treat for them. Get them already pre-cooked. Turkey sausage. They can have that. Chewy granola bars in case they go on a trip and the kids are like, I'm starving. There's no place in sight. Cheese to go with the meat for crackers. Another thing, this is a discount store. This is just a head of lettuce. I got this yogurt again. Easy breakfast for the kids. I don't have to worry about it and the animals because they asked for that. Some bread to go. Popcorn. They love cheddar cheese. I just got one of those. Got one of those. And I did get a bag of this just because when they, if they decide to go out or do something, they can just grab a bag of chips with sandwiches and a yogurt and everybody will eat ramen because they asked for it. I like this. So I think I'm going to pack this for myself. Some salt and black pepper popcorn. I got two things of cereal. I listened to them and said, okay, I'll just get two. So I just got crispy oats and the shredded wheat and they're gonna go get cereal. There's another banana and I got four boxes of macaroni. So that will actually work out really good. So this is the grocery haul when mom is away. So we're gonna put this away and then we're gonna go head back out and go to uh, go do dinner, something dinner. We'll see how that works. So I'm gonna put this stuff, just put it in the freezer or the refrigerator. All right, I'm leaving the rest of the groceries, so we just get out the door. So I'm just gonna leave it. Lauren's got the kids at the pool, so now I'm gonna worry about it, and then uh, we'll take care of this later. Here, you can even go on any. Maybe. All right, back in the car once again. Oh yeah. Today is a drive, drive, drive. I love it. I got my baby day. all day. Uh, I'm like, let's go. Right, I right. have to lock her in the car in order to get time with her. I know, but I feel like, okay, what else do I gotta do? So we yeah. haven't gotten to the shop to do any organizing at the shop at all. But that's know. okay because we did an incredible job with that last week. But did they even get a video today? Besides, it's just. Stop it and go on stuff. <laughs> we'll have to see. We gotta get gas. We're totally out of gas right now. And then uh, we'll go see what else we're gonna have to do. So I don't know. We'll find out what we're gonna do. Since we couldn't go into the store, I don't know why you can't go to PF Shanks. We just went for Jaden's birthday. So I just placed our order online. So we'll be eating in the car. It's all good. So we're gonna go do that. Drive there right now. Pick up dinner. All right, we got food. We did, we did Big it. Big old takeout. Now we gotta go find ourselves a shake. But that was weird. We were just, you were just here. Yeah, I was just here with Jade. You guys saw it recorded. So now it was like last week, right? For her birthday, yeah. Yeah, last week. Yeah, yeah. So now we're just gonna have to find a little shade tree. We're gonna eat and then we're gonna. So go. something happened today in North Carolina or something. They I think it have. says the highest something. Who knows? Yeah, they put, oh, over to the right. It's like <clears> the shade. They, they took restrictions. Oh, to a higher level. Today, so we're. So now we're. We're doing the drive, yeah. so here we are. We're gonna park right there, baby. You think right here's okay? What if we could sit on the table right there? Just kidding. Where? There's no table. There's no oh. table. <laughs> you know, it'd be nice to put the blanket down on it right there. Can we eat on the ground? Is that illegal? I have no idea. Can you have a picnic in the middle of the thing? Well, I see like people doing uh, like yoga and stuff over there. Can you? See? Yeah, I don't even know. I think you could sit on a blanket right there. I think people would tell you to leave. I don't know, baby. We, we can, can take it to Fly Rock if you want. We're only like 10 minutes. Okay, better. let's go to the park. You want to do that? Daddy? All park. right, Daddy's going to play in special. Okay. We're going to hold off the PF Chains. Yeah. It's so, so smelling good. And then we're going to drive to, you want to do Fly Rock or Fletcher? We'll do our okay. Our park. Our good we'll park. go to our park and we'll get to go have a nice yeah, we'll throw a blanket little out. dinner there. That would be nice for our next love date. Daddy. Dude, but we got our sodas, right? The sodas okay. are here. So, and then the eyeballs are weird. Awesome. Okay. Let's do it, baby. We're driving. Okay, we're driving back Perfect. to our town. All right, change blends. Greg's like, honey, why don't you just get us an egg roll while we're driving? Well, I was just saying an appetizer. Appetizer. Like appetizer on the way. We're driving, so you need an appetizer. It's still a 20-minute <laughs> drive, so we're gonna we're gonna have an appetizer right now in the car. You, so we've got our egg rolls and our dim sum, or whatever these things are called. That like the what are those things called? Uh, like a dumpling. Sticker? Yes, yeah, so we're gonna have one of those in the car. Can we do that? Put you down. All right, so egg roll and pot mm. stickers. Delicious, and then driving. How romantic in the car, baby. <laughs> We're gonna I'll, eat. <laughs> I'll take what I can get. Oh, we'll take what we can get. Times are tough. All right, we're at our little flat rock park, so we're gonna go. Greatest place. park ever. I don't, it's good. We okay. can walk. We can eat our, have mm -hmm. our uh, picnic, 
and then we can do laps. <laughs> we can burn it so off immediately afterwards. So excited, honey. Thrilled. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go find a parking comfy spot. Let's go find a parking spot. All right, how do we make pit stop after we already stopped? Didn't check the bag for forks, so. We got forks, had to run to the grocery store, thank goodness. It's like two seconds away, so. Now, we're gonna go eat. Now we can go eat. Now we can go eat, okay, heading back. All right, we're gonna try this all over again. Here we go, we're going for dinner. Our food is probably freezing cold. I'm just kidding, it's like 95 degrees outside. Okay, we're gonna go head out and find a nice parking spot. Not parking spot, sitting spot. We made it finally, honey. Here we are. Let's go find us a sitting spot. Where do you want it? Where are you thinking? Like, see that tree right there? I feel like that tree right there, right below it is shade. Walk and walk. Oh, look at somebody killed my favorite flower on the ground. <gasps> Blue. Okay, we're gonna walk. We'll keep walking. We're going, baby, into the woods. We could walk all the way back to the water. I just don't have my shoes on. All right, right here, baby. This looks like a nice spot. Hi, baby. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing with your food? Very good. What Delicious. did you wind up with? The lo mein. Remember when Jade mm. and I went and I told you guys how it was like more lighter tasting, which is good, but it just needed more soy. But I think they just changed the noodles. Looks like these are ramen noodles oh. versus lo mein noodles, but it's still good. So it's better? I like the other way better. I like I like a firmer noodle. Me too. These seem like they're kind of like a ramen where they're kind of like mm. a little more gooey. It's not my favorite, but it's okay. I'll eat it, love it, no complaints. I'll tell you what, P.F. Chang's is about impossible to beat. Look at how good. Dang. Did you decide what these red things were? I think they're beets, but it, I don't, is beets. that, like, it? would that be ridiculous to think it's that? Oh, some it's like a, no, it's some like kind a, of Japan or Chinese ooh, cuisine. Ooh, it's like a ginger carrot. Ooh, it's strong, too. It's ginger. Oh, maybe it's real ginger. Ooh, that's ginger. Okay, not That bad. was rough. That's ginger. Mmm. But delicious. Definitely only for a little extra flavor on the side. Wow, that was tough. So, baby, tell me, mm. how do you feel about your next daughter in line getting married? Oh, there you go. There's a little question we were talking about. Hmm? Excited for. Super excited. Super excited. Love Matthew. Great family. Me too. Good boy. Couldn't ask for any better. I don't know. It's like our girls are picking some good guys. We are very, <laughs> very blessed. Paul, Matthew, we're mm -hmm. good. Yep, God is bringing just awesome people into right our thing. kids' lives, right? So I'm excited. So we are headed, so that's what you guys know. We're going to be going to Michigan. So we're going to be going and sharing. Lauren wants to show Matthew all of her life, what she had growing up. And mm -hmm. like our younger half kind of know more just North Carolina because we've been here for five, six years. Six yeah, years six years. Going on six. Six years where the older half, I say, the four older ones, kind of, well, mostly just down to Lauren. Evan kind of just knows here more. I mean, he knows there, but mostly his life is here. So the older ones are more of a North Carolina. I'm one. sorry, I fed off, baby. I'm sorry. Okay. So the older ones are more Michigan's where they grew up. So the plan is to take Matthew and go see all of them. The fun things that yeah and there's and, there, and there's lots to see in michigan because you got the blue water you know mm -hmm. blue water bridge going to canada mm -hmm. like you got st Clair river and the yeah thousand foot freighters like i have a friend who has a dairy cow farm like where's a dairy cow farm in north carolina oh and that's interesting no, too because matthew right has really never seen farms. never seen like farm life because you don't have farms here i know we've just and those folks are real farmers they're farmers yeah. so good friends of ours i'm like do you need to come to your dairy farm she's like um mm -hmm. okay and i'm like no really i need to come to your dairy farm so we're gonna go there we're gonna go to the amish stores 
I'm excited to go there because they have mm -hmm. they've expanded and got way better. So we're gonna head there. There's another one that we used to go to. It was in their somebody's house, but now it's like a huge building. So we're gonna go there. Go see our old houses. Go see friends. All that good stuff. Go eat Chinese food, which is gonna be, I feel like, very similar to mm -hmm. Chang's. Very good. And then Coney dogs. Hmm. Gotta have a Coney dog, honey. So I gotta see if it's like in comparison, like. Hot dog is, world, Tony. North Carolina is mm -hmm. way better. Like, I feel like North Carolina's are better. You do. We're going to do that. And we're going to go see somebody you guys have been asking about. Hmm. Colin. Oh, yeah. So, you guys haven't seen Colin? Colin's up there. Colin's got a new place. So, we're going to go check that out. He's been ordering stuff, decking his little apartment out. <laughs> so, it's like, I can't just have a plain looking place, Mom. The so. single man, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, so I like to see all the stuff he's ordering. I'm like, that's cool. So, hmm. we have to see, all, see his Star Wars posters on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it'll be fun. So we're gonna do that. Get some Tim Hortons. Love Tim Hortons. Mm -hmm. All those good things. Tim bits. So it'll be a good thing. And then I, mm. uh, yeah. And Michigan in the summer, it's hard to beat. And it's their weather's like exact like ours here right now. They're, we're having exact same weather, so there's not having rain. So it'll be a hot time. So I'm ex it's gonna be good. It's gonna mm -hmm. be better than rain. So it'll be neat. Flat roads, grass. We got some grass right here, so I can't complain. But. Oh my gosh, everything is flat. So it'll be weird. I'm gonna go to a childhood home mm -hmm. with me, growing up, all that good stuff, so you can see that. Mm, that'll be I fun. Did. Yeah, yeah. Well, all that kind of fun stuff. And so. then you gotta, you'll have to take your camera and look through the window oh. at my house across oh. the street. I'll show you. Yeah. <laughs> I'll show you the view of like. I know I wasn't sure. That, some house that first outside. time where I saw Greg and I was like, oh, he saw me. I'll show you the tree I hid behind. And I was like, oh my gosh, she is looking at me right now. Go to the grocery store that Greg saw me for the first time. All those good things. So so it'll be good. We're excited. So Daddy's going to have fun. He's going to like, like I said, dollar store dinner challenge. I wish I had a camera. Maybe I'll get some clips from Jaden to record on her phone. Oh, you should. Because that would be hilarious. Mm -hmm. And they got food to eat. You saw what I fed them. So I had it home and the kids came home with Lauren and I'm like, don't want to eat any of the good food. Hmm. <laughs> She's like, no, no. When we're doing casserole and the rice. When me and the children are together, we never, we never have a... Lack no. of fun, no, you know what I mean? No, not at all. I know. We were talking about the kids. We were laughing, like, because they're like, "Yeah, mom would have a baby at the hospital." That was my time to get away, is have a baby, you know. And so, dad would have the kids, and they would come. I remember one time they literally had a two by fours and plastic, and they were making a fort in the living room. Out of the entire living room. Isn't that cool? I'm like, no. He's and getting like, carry like, out food every night. And... He's like, we'll do, we'll do living room to fort. I'm like, no, I'm a good couch. I'm like, put a blanket out every lay on top. No food on the couch. Yeah, and I know Stephen. He's been, he's been asking oh. all week long. So how many more days before mom goes? They're like so excited <laughs> because you know, because they always ask. They're always like, mom, because I'm more of the saver. Greg is more the spender. So mm -hmm. yeah, I'm like budget. So then they're like, can we get these toys? And I'm like, no, we're not gonna get those toys. We go to McDonald's. I'm like, no, we can't go to McDonald's. We're gonna be fine. <laughs> like, Two more days. Daddy's got you. You can ask daddy all you want. So now. They're all they like literally mm. have their list of things they want to do. I to can't wait to just love on those so, babies for a whole so week. So they're gonna have a great time, I know. Well, not a whole week, but part of the, the weekend. So it'll be a fun, uh, fun time. It'll be real quick. I'll be back before you know it. Mm. And daddy be like, I gotta go back to work. Mm. I need to go to my shop. <laughs> Don't let the kids over there. They'll paint everything in pieces. Oh my goodness! I'll tear that place up they'll in find the minutes. And colors and they'll be like, "Ooh, we're gonna paint." So, mm -hmm. so it'll be good. So that's gonna be over the next few days. We'll be getting ready. So tomorrow will be a basically get ready for that kind of thing. And she's gonna ready. be married like she's before you know, in another month. It's crazy. So excited! So excited for them. So yep, everybody's really excited for it. Be a good time. So we're looking forward to it very mm -hmm. much. So all good things. How do you? In what? In what ways do you think the? dynamic in the house will change oh our household mm. i know i can see Jaden. she'll definitely be the leader mm -hmm. of the because it, it lauren is sort of like the well lauren's strong leader too so mm -hmm. like her being the alpha can you say alpha male dog yeah <laughs> and Jaden being an alpha male dog can you say that they like they fight for that not that they fight they don't fight but they they're just both leaders so to mm -hmm. be a strong person you know it's like it's good to have that so she'll be going out and it'll be like Jade will be kind of like the takeover. Stepping head. up into that role. Yeah, and she does that already. So mm -hmm. it's, a good, it's a good thing to see them graduate, do those kind of things. So we're excited. And the girls are excited because they gain a little bit of floor space. Well, not really because they're going to have Lauren's bed, but they're going to gain an extra bed. So we're not going to rearrange in there? Or? No, they want to, Brooklyn's going to take her bed. Oh. So there'll be an extra bed on the bottom. Maddie's going to go up to the top. So we'll just have it. They That's want, big. They want daddy. They're like, we'll just cut the beds apart so we can just have this floor. Yeah. I'm like, you can't just take a saw and chop the bed, mm -hmm. kids. <laughs> no, daddy <laughs> can, mama. That way. <laughs> so we'll, we'll see. We just might be doing a bedroom makeover. So it'll be good, though. Excited. All good things. How do you feel, baby? So it's all good. So how do you feel about Lauren? 
Mark one, honey. Hmm? Now it's my turn to fill my face and then you're going to talk. Oh, no way. <laughs> I feel awesome about it because I, I like you. I think that Matthew is just everything that a, a father would want for his daughter. Oh, yeah. Great. Place. He's a great boy. He's a got God in his heart first and foremost. Mm -hmm. And that's amazing because you know if they have that, they're going to treat their their woman the right way above, right. above rubies, right, baby? That's right. All rubies, that's right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a lot of things that took me a lot of years to have to figure, try to figure out, and I still have to work on. You we know, we all got to work on it. We all got to work mm -hmm. on it. Marriage is a work in progress. It's never just a one day thing. Mm -mm. Like, oh, it's great. It's all good to go. That's for sure. It's a daily die to self, people. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Basically, give your life up. No, no it's not. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's just working. We're soothing. But yeah, so I'm like super happy for him because I love Matthew. Mm -hmm. Lauren deserves somebody like that. You know, they're gonna have a good life together, and they're very focused and kind of already know how to how to do it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So it's gonna be a good time. So mm -hmm. I got their place. They do have their place. Though. Yep, they got their place figured I think out. The girls are more excited about that because guess what? Boom, they can move their stuff out before they're married. <laughs> so mm -hmm. the girls are like, we'll help you take everything over there. <laughs> you know she's not gonna have short of hands because they're like, let's get you out, Lauren. I mean, she won't go out yet, but all her stuff will yeah. go out. Cause... And the girls will have a lot of fun too, like staying over there oh, yeah. and camping out in their oh, living yeah. room. And... Get it. Oh, it'll be so much fun. We'll mm -hmm. stay at Lauren's. It's gonna be a good time. Super excited. Okay, eat. Okay, I need to eat now. I want oh, to get yeah. you eating. I'm not going to do a camera. Come on, do it. Ah. Let, let everybody see you chew weird or something. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. Love you. Happiness ruins failure. What? <laughs> Here you are. Hi. <laughs> it's all good. We just read our fortune. Hi, Hi wave. Guys. Hi. Hey. But you can see it because Amy will only allow one quarter of my head in this yeah, shot. Yeah, we're like this time. right there. Hey, Greg. There you go, honey. There's that one. Oh. So fun. There we go. Turn that way. There you go. It's beautiful. That's a good view, isn't it? <laughs> it we're is. like the next shot. You know shot. what? But look up here. Give him a cool view. Show him what we're this staring is, at. This is what we're staring at. While we're talking. Just sitting here talking. Yeah, take it around. Ready? So. Seeing that, and then you can look down here, and then you can see the pretty trees. Clouds are beautiful. It's beautiful, and it's like look up. decent. Oh, let me go around here. Look, okay. up. look over there. Beautiful. This is our view right now. Mm. You're hearing dogs and kids, you know, and they're not ours. <laughs> We're like, we can do this. So that's it. This is my idea of the date. It's a good date. I don't think we've ever sat at the mm. at the park on the ground mm. ever. I love it. I don't think we've ever done this. It was very nice, nice and full. Maybe when you were very young. We used to we used to sit out in our yard a lot. Yeah, we'd sit under the trees and stuff. I was thinking, mm -hmm. I don't think we've ever sat on a picnic blanket on the ground, mm -hmm. baby. So good. So beautiful day. Very so good. we're gonna get up and move and walk. Is that what we're doing? Yeah, we'll load up our food and take it back to the truck. And, and then I can end our video. Should I show you? Go the get video? us a couple of uh, laps around here. Oh, I thought you were gonna say go get us a couple of pelicans. Oh, oh. <laughs> did I just say that? I was gonna say coffee, but oh. pelicans works too. Pelicans Come on, I'll take it to pelicans. You wanna skip walking and just go there? No, we're gonna go walking. We're gonna walk it smart better. Yeah, but wait, pelicans is there's no You don't like pelicans as much as I love it's just pelicans. Nice. It's so good. Well, I don't love it, but I don't dislike it. We just had Wits the other day, so we went to Wits for the first time. Yeah. That was where we got the custard. That yeah, Wits is awesome. That's really good. So the Mountain Delight—that's my favorite. Ugh, love it, love Ugh, it. So Hawaii Lua, my favorite. Brownie bits and almonds. <sighs> and good food. So and we need to go walk, talk about all the good food. So it's gonna be good. Okay. So thank you for my beautiful day. It was a great working day. Are you thinking? Me? This is how I think everybody should end the working day on the blanket outside. Looking at some trees, listening to kids crying. In the crying. summertime, <laughs> yeah, in the summertime, there is no other way. <laughs> it's a good little thing, so. Oh, gotta enjoy it while it's here. That's right. Beautiful. It's like breezy, perfect. Thank you for being with me all day. You're welcome. Thank you for coming. I appreciate you. Did so you much. enjoy a day in my life? Working? We didn't really. Did work. I? We didn't really work, did we? We did grocery. We did a lot of stuff, a lot of running. Mm -hmm. I didn't get to your shop at all. Sorry. That's I looked okay. at the label maker when we were there, and I realized it needed double A batteries, and I was like, Oh, I've got them there. Oh, you have double A? I do. Oh, never mind then. I guess I should still do it. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to wait till another week. Yeah, maybe and then. there's a store right next door. Whatever. Shh, there's right none. Over there's there no and stores. And get so, them if we need them. I gotta do that, and then we'll put the hooks up. So we're not gonna go back to the shop and play with labels? I don't think so, cause it's already like late. It's, it's not late. It's so late, honey. It's getting dark. Can you see the sun's going down? <sighs> Just kidding. No, we're gonna go walking. We're gonna walk, and then we're gonna head home, and okay. all those good things. I don't even know what else. We'll see. I'll close know. the video when we go Whatever home. Wherever it is, as long as you stay right here. It's right here, just in the spot. It's all good. It's all good to go. Okay, closing out. We're going to enjoy this view. See you in a minute. See you guys. <laughs>
All right, so we are home. It was so funny. I don't even know what the last clip was, but we went to I went to get my shoes out of the car and there was no shoes in my car. So we didn't end up walking, but I went and we ended up seeing um, some friends that we know. So we stopped and talked to them for a little bit. So that um, worked out good for us. So we stayed at the park for a little bit. Um, some animal, somebody was laying right here. Somebody big and beautiful cinnamon color because she was laying right here today too. And I was like, ah. so that's not good, but I still love her. She is sweet, but I'm like, you can't lay in my flowers. So anyways, that's what we ended up doing. And then we just drove back to the shop and because we didn't get a pelican, but. All right, so we ran back next door and just got a frozen, the coconut cream thing. And it was so good, delicious. And I'm like, okay, that's a good night. And then Lauren texted, she's like, are you guys done? We're gonna have a girls night video. So I'm like, okay, you guys do that. So we'll be home. So it was a good day. It was a great day. It was a great day of running. So today is our, I was just looking at my list here of everything. I try to film everything that I remember. I wanted to do Greg's things that didn't happen. I wanted to put his hooks up that didn't happen. Hey Maxine. But today is our less stuff more life. Every part of the week I give you a little challenge. Even though last week I did the 4th of July I didn't put um, anything in there so I just put a question at the end and it was just making snacks. So this week is a little bit, it's a little bit easier and I don't know maybe this is something simple. It has nothing to do with today's video but it is our less stuff more week challenge of the week so I'm like I gotta say it so I'm gonna put it at the end here. <laughs> But this week's chance, we're in week 32, almost through 52 weeks, which is awesome. And it was to get rid of paper clutter. Do you deal with paper clutter? Some people have a lot of paper clutter. Like I know families, they get their mail, they bring it in and they've got to go through every single thing and they have piles and piles of paper. And you're like, oh my goodness, just get rid of the paper clutter. Or like little notes scribbled here and there or things like every left everywhere. We want to get rid of that paper clutter because paper clutter can just become so overwhelming with things that you have. How do you do that? When you declutter, decluttering is a skill that like when you learn it and do it, it just becomes like a habit that you naturally do. Just like when you learn to brush your teeth, you learn how to brush your teeth and you got better and better at doing to brush your teeth, right? Hopefully you still brush your teeth. Same thing, riding your bike, exercising, all those things in life. Decluttering is the same way. And once you do it more and more, you're going to get to that point where you're like, oh yeah, I got this paper on my counter, this paper on my counter, this goes in trash, this goes here. You know what to do with it. So one of the biggest things is having a place for everything. Everything. That helps hugely. Let's say you've got a big job. How, how do you do these things? Get your piles of papers. One of the biggest things we have is magazines. Maybe not so much anymore, but some people still do magazines, newspapers, things like that. My recommendation is go through those. What I would do, if I didn't have time to read the whole magazine right then, I would sometimes skim through. I'd be ripping out anything I wanted to read later on. And I put it in a separate file folder to read when I was like nursing a baby. Or I know I get um, magazines from um, Grandma sends them down to us. And so when I get recipes, I usually go through and I rip out the ones that I want to keep. Lately, I've been taking snapshots on my phone and then filing them on my computer in a separate file that says food ideas. Um, just things you can do, but you can rip them out, put them in your own little thing to make yourself a little binder of recipes. That's something you can do with magazines that have recipes things like, or things you want to read later on. Your mail. Mail is huge because that's how paper comes into the house. Go through your junk mail right away. As soon as I get my mail, Right away, I'm at the trash can. When it comes in, I take it and pitch it right into the trash if I don't need it. I use it. If it's a bill, I open it up. I tear off the remittance form. Remittance? 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 Remittance form. <laughs> put that where I need it to pay it. The extra one, just throw it away. If I want to keep it, I put it in my pile, and then I usually once a week will file my stuff in my drawers where it goes. So that's what you can do once it comes in the mail. Just throw it away. Don't even give it a second thought because most of the time it's junk. I know you can sign up on places. I don't know where, someone will probably write it in below, but there's a place you can sign up to not get junk mail. Probably Google it and you can sign up and it actually does not give you junk mail. We did that for a long time and the only reason we got more is because we moved out of state to, and bought a house and they start sending you new stuff. But if you want to receive nothing, go there, Google it. They won't send you anything. For You might get it for a little bit, but after that, it's gone. So that's a good way to do that. Another great way is to sign up for electronic bill paying and get an e-statements. That's something we I love doing. I, get, I still get bills in the mail for some things, but I'm like, quit sending me paper. Just send me an email. They send me an email. I make sure I mark it. I know what day it's gonna come out, so I mark it on my calendar, and that's how I know things get paid, and I don't have to worry about keep getting everything. Thing, keep getting a statement every single month. That cuts down hugely. Keep a filing cabinet for all your receipts. I just bought that one for Greg, that box, and he keeps all his files. He keeps all his things into it. We have the same thing. I did have it on my desk. Then I got rid of the desk because we didn't need it. So I have a big plastic bin that has our tax records and all that in it. So I put in that bin like warranties, you know, birth certificate, things that I have to keep that I don't I usually go to. And then next to my bed in my nightstand, I have nothing in there because I never keep anything in my nightstand because I just don't. So in my bottom drawer is where I keep my extra files and I keep my business files and the things that I need to keep track of down there. And so that's where I put them. I'm like, that works for me because we don't really 
I don't have use it for anything else. So for me, that's a good place to buy all my stuff. And I just, as soon as I get a receipt, I stick it in there because it all goes to tax purposes. So just have a place. Get yourself a file folder, either a box or um, like one of those ones, like an envelope type thing, whatever. They're real cheap. Amazon has them. We bought them for Greg Shop. I think it was five bucks maybe 10 bucks for his plastic. It was good. I went to Walmart. They just didn't have the lid, so I couldn't get them, but I know they have the envelopes. Save yourself space. Don't get big filing cabinets. You have a big filing, unless you have that much stuff, but that's a... Acorns. I think it's acorn shopping. Big filing cabinet. You don't need all that space. You don't need to keep that much paperwork. You don't need to keep every single receipt. Just keep the ones that are important to keep. You can scan items. That's a great way to keep receipts too. Take a picture of them. Just keep them on your phone. Kids artwork. <laughs> Do you love your kids artwork? I love kids artwork, but just tell them we can't possibly keep every single one. Take a picture, snapshot of it. And I've seen where people have done collages for their kids or got those printed off for their artwork. That's a great way. We had a box at one time because we did a lot of crafts. A lot of crafts with the older kids, not so much with the younger kids. So, and then I would keep them for a little bit and we'd kind of weed through and go through them and throw them out over time. That's just a good way to do that. And set aside a time each week that you go through your paperwork. I usually go through mine once a week on my working days. Usually it's today, probably Thursdays are my working day. And I'll go through and if I have like my, if I got some in the mail today, I'd stick it over there on Thursday. I would take it and file it away, put it where it needs to go. But I know that once a week I'm gonna do that. Instead of doing it every single day or when it comes in the mail so I don't have to run and do it all, I just do that my time once a week. So that's a good way. Paper clutter. We want to cut back on paper clutter. So that is my challenge for you this week from Less Stuff More Life from my book. Free. Go get it. It's a link below. Go download it. Read it along with us. We're almost like 32 weeks. We're going to be on 33 next week, which is awesome. There's only 52. So almost getting through a whole year. So crazy. I remember we started this at the beginning of the year and I'm like, wow, it's our half a year already. That's so crazy. I mean, past half a year already, so it's good. So, okay, I'm going, I'm gonna go. I pulled some footage off the camera already and I'm like, I don't know what there is. I don't even know what kind of exciting day I got for you, but hopefully it's something you enjoy. Kids had a great time with Lauren. Tomorrow is gonna be getting ready with me to fly out and leave. So tomorrow will be a getting ready, get some food prep made for Greg and the kids get myself packed and ready to roll and then we will be leaving out so we're going to take you along show you everything we do the flying the visiting all our hometown stuff i'm excited to show you my childhood home very excited to show you my childhood home. i'm like grandma linda can i film at your house <laughs> she's like sure you can so it the problem is not the problem she is having a house remodel right now and i'm like <gasps> lauren's like Grandma's not redoing her house. I'm like, she is. So I'm hoping a lot of it's the same, and I'm sure a lot of it's changed, so we haven't seen it in a while. Maybe my room will be the same. We'll see, I don't know. So it's gonna be exciting. We're excited to go back and just have a good time. We're gonna go celebrate Lauren and Matthew, and then go celebrate by seeing friends and family, and enjoying all the wonderful things that we enjoy about Michigan. We're gonna take you with us, show you all step of the way. It's gonna be a great, wonderful time. So that's gonna be the end of the week vlogs, probably into the beginning of next week as well. So, all right, you guys enjoy your day. I hope you enjoyed the video. I feel like it's a lot of running around that's what we did today today was a running day but a good day this mom is tired i'm like okay i'll edit for a little bit and then i'm gonna i'm gonna hit the hay i'm gonna hit the hay hit the hay who else says that hit the hay is that a <laughs> do you have any nighttime phrases i'm gonna hit the hay or i don't even know if any more i'm sure there are some give me give me your best phrase for your, i'm gonna say your southern phrase but you could be a northern phrase or a western or eastern phrase i don't know hit the hay i'm gonna go hit the hay because i'm tired so thank you guys always for watching thank you guys for all your tips for my neck it's a little sore. You guys give me lots of ideas to do. I'm going to definitely put those into play. It's just a little pull tension something, but it's getting better, which is a good thing. So taking it easy, watching it, and not pushing it too hard. So, all right, I'm going. Have a fantastic rest of your day, and I'm going to see you again tomorrow morning. I'll be here. I got coffee and creamer. The coffee pot's ready, and I'll see you in the morning. All right, see you tomorrow. Bye.